Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to be answering a couple of questions that one of you sent me. So if you're interested in learning more about commercial modeling and the requirements to be a commercial model, then keep watching this video. So the question that she sent me, she said, um, what are the requirements for commercial modeling in terms of looks? What is the industry looking for? What is the demand? So for commercial modeling, there's not a specific type of look that that is it like if you have that then you make it you're you're gonna make it commercial modeling is not as strict as fashion model there's not a specific size or height that you have to be there's no specific um hair color or skin color that you have to be if not you're not gonna make it in this industry i personally see a lot of demand for ethnically ambiguous models which is models that kind of look like me in terms of like I look Filipina, I look Latina, I look Egyptian, I look Native American, so something like that. A lot of brands are looking for people like that, so if you are a person that constantly gets told different ethnicities and you're not any of those, then you might that might be a great plus for you. I also see a lot of demand for interesting looks. And I don't know exactly what would the definition for interesting look would be, but a lot of times when I read the description of the jobs, it, uh, they're asking for girls or guys who have a gap in their teeth or they have freckles. I have also have noticed that a lot of beauty brands are also looking for models who actually have acne and they also have um, discoloration or they have dark circles or bags under their eyes and this is just because probably the beauty brand is either looking to represent more women who have this type of skin conditions or because obviously they're selling some type of makeup or product that helps with that type of condition so if you if your skin is not clear do not think that you what don't think that you will never be able to uh do any type of beauty shoots for like beauty brands because these brands are actually looking for girls that have these when it comes to commercial modeling you pretty much see everything there's not a specific type of pretty your skin might not be the best you might be plus size you might have freckles your teeth might not be straight and that's fine it can all work the reason why is because commercials use people that are relatable so as long as you look relatable, there's a high chance that you are be you're gonna be able to book jobs and um, do modeling. If you have other skills besides modeling, that's a huge plus in the industry. A lot of brands are looking for models that can not only model but they can do other type of stuff. Like for example, dancing. I see a lot of castings for hip hop dancers. I also see a lot of castings for people that have different type of accents or they can speak another language or a lot of castings too are looking for people in specific sports sometimes i see castings for basketball players other times i see castings for people that do rock climbing so if you have any other type of skill besides uh, modeling that's a huge plus in the industry and last but not least if you can do a little bit of acting that's another huge plus and the reason why is that besides doing photo shoots as a commercial model you also do video shoots and you don't need to be an actual like legit like actress to be able to do commercials with acting because a lot of commercials that models get booked for require uh, no lines so the only thing that you have to be is pretend that you're enjoying your coffee in the morning or pretending that you are enjoying baking a pie with your daughter or pretending that you are enjoying walking down the mall and just like laughing with your friends and that's literally it so if you're comfortable with doing that that is also a huge plus so hope this video was helpful for you guys. Hope it encouraged you to become a model. Hope that it destroyed any type of insecurities that you have about yourself, about your body, about your face or anything like that. And just give it a shot because at the end of the day, you will never know unless you try. And yeah, so if you did like this video, don't forget to hit that like button. Also comment down below if you have any thoughts, any questions. Uh, I love answering your questions. Also, don't forget to follow me on my social media everything is at andre ventur with three r's and i'll see you guys in the next video bye